Hello, holy hotties. It is Yolanda Shoshana with this week's Cosmic Courtesan Weekly Reading. I hope last week was filled with love and light. Now it's time to see what opportunities are in store for us. As usual, I'm not going to ask a particular question. I'm just going to see what our mind, body, and soul need to know. Let's get this spiritual party started. All right. Faith is in process. Sometimes we go through things and we don't understand why we are going through them. But know that it is because the universe is trying to tell you something. It is trying to teach you a lesson or it's trying to get rid of something in your life. So keep the faith and be strong. No matter how uh, religious or spiritual you are, sometimes our faith gets shaken. And we do start to question. And you are normal and it happens to everybody. I'm sure it even happens to Oprah, right? Even with that billions of dollars. But stay strong and go with the flow of it. Pay attention to the lesson. Um, ask Questions of your angels and guides, if need be, like, you know, you can flat out ask them, what am I supposed to be learning here? What am I missing here? But go with it and know that it is just a lesson and this time is going to pass. Stay strong by meditating, by praying, by, um, you know, every minute that you can and every minute that you need to um, allow your angels and guides to lead the way because they are there for you. Don't forget to ask for their help and their guidance. OK, and next up, we have big, bold vision. And I'd say this probably goes very well with that first card. Maybe you have an idea or a vision to do something, but you're scared to do it. Um, there is nothing that is too big for you. As I always tell my clients, you don't always have to know how to get there. You just have to know that you want it. Universe will um, unleash um, opportunities for you as long as you put it out there. Uh, you know, I, you know, people always worry, how am I going to do this? I don't have money. I don't have this. I don't have resources. They will come if you allow them to come. Stop talking yourself out of being bigger, bolder, and better. Uh, you can have everything your heart desires if you allow it to come to you, if you allow the universe to work for you. You are co-creating with the universe at every minute. So every time you say that you're not supposed to have something, then the universe will believe you. But every time you say, no, this is going to happen for me, I allow this and I accept it, the universe will grant it and will give it to you. All right, let's see what else we have. Oh, we have Heaven Sent. I love this reading. It's going to be a pretty awesome week. Um, help is on the way. Uh, whether it is your intuition or it is physical help, help is on the way. Understand that you will have more aha moments. Um, people will offer to help you. Don't be too scared to ask for it. Um, it is divinely ordered what is happening in your life at this moment. And I see that it definitely is going with this big, bold vision. You will have everything you need to achieve your goals and your dreams. So let's do a recap so that you really can get this because... We talk ourselves out of so many things and there's no reason for you to do that. Your faith is in process. It is time for you to now have faith and to understand that you can have everything you want in your life, whether it's money, love, a new business, leaving that job you hate, moving to the place that you want to go to. Your faith is being shaken a little bit, but hold on. Because your big, bold vision is going to come to light. It is going to happen. The seeds that you have planted and the seeds that you will plant will bear fruit because it is divinely ordered and you will be sent the help that you need and the guidance that you need to achieve all that you desire. This is a great reading. Allow this week to be one that is filled with abundance. Allow that abundance to flow to you. Do not cut it off with your mindset and your actions. Do not self-sabotage yourself. Just allow. Let it be a test for you if you are always self-sabotaging. For those of us who love abundance, yay us. <laughs> but um, know that everything you, you want is closer than you think. I hope this reading helps you. If you would like a reading with me, feel free to write me at Shoshi at YolandaShoshana.com. Uh, check out my blog at BrewHouseBlog.com. May the road rise to meet you. And last but not least, I absolutely and I positively love you. Namaste.